All right, so I am here on a Mac. As you guys know, the live event just happened and you cannot play the game. We have to wait on this like to be continued screen. Honestly, I really don't like how they do this. I don't see the point of making us wait. Either just drop the season or just have the live event and then let us keep on playing, you know, the rest of the season. Don't do events that uh, wouldn't allow that or wouldn't make sense, I guess, story-wise. I don't know. I thought like back in season six, there was a live event. Loot Lake got changed in the middle of the game and we got to play with that right after. Like that was sick. Um, I remember the agency event. I never got into that game. But shortly after, you were able to play with the water storm. That was really cool. Uh, it didn't kick us out right away. We're in the lobby. So we're here on Mac. Obviously, there's no battle pass. Um, no compete tab. There's no competitive going on here. Your locker, you can access everything. So I don't have anything. I'm just on like a burner account. Item shop. So this is actually all available in the shop right now. I mean, if the game was online and you can log on on the other versions, you'd be able to see this shop. The thing is, this is all the stuff that was available during this update. Everything else that came out after this version of the game that Mac and iOS got left on would not show up in the shop, does not show up in the shop. So, but it's kind of interesting. You can still see this stuff and buy it. I mean, why do I have 500 V-Bucks? I didn't even know that. Should I just buy something just, just because? No, screw it, dude. Maybe I could just gift myself something if I feel like get some of the 500 V bucks. All right, so yeah, you can actually buy stuff still in the shop right now, even though the game is down. Um, you can buy V bucks if you want. Moment of truth, yo. Let's go ahead and press play. So we got solo duo squad siphon squads. Uh, I guess that's because they don't have competitive. So if you want to play with siphon, then you can just play the mode dedicated for it. Um, yeah, because they're not going to put up competitive servers, they're going to be mainly filled with bots, and there's not enough people to fill all the ranks and stuff. And then creative. I wonder what creative is, because would you be able to enter only codes that were published before this version, or could you enter a new code, even if it only uses stuff that was around in this version? I don't know how creative works in this. Let's try to jump into solo, man. Damn. That is unfortunate. That kind of sucks, bro. I was practicing on this season. Yo, I actually won a solo game the other day. I was like, yo, if the servers are up, I'm definitely going to play during uh, the downtime and stream it. But yeah, I guess you can't play. I don't know why they do that. Like, th these should be different servers, right? It's a completely different version of the game. I don't know. That sucks. But yo, guys, that's going to do it for the video. I will be uploading. Make sure to subscribe if you want to stay up to date with everything for the new season. I'll be uploading the leaks as soon as they come out. Everything you need to know gameplay wise, I'm going to be talking about everything. So make sure to subscribe, leave a like, and I'll see you guys in the next one later.